for my family, gotta build a legacy I'ma be the man when I'm dead Work too hard, I can't slip up So I'm clutching tight on this lid What's going on everybody, CW Entertainment Back with another Madden 21 Tennessee Titans franchise video We're coming off of another win uh, we, we actually were playing the Indianapolis Colts last time out And this is back to back games versus the Colts Where we've had to come from behind in the second half And find a way to get a victory And we were able to do that this week we're going to be taking on the Cleveland Browns, so we got some guys on their team to worry about. Nick Chubb, Miles Garrett, Odell Beckham Jr., Jarvis Landry, David Njoku, Kareem Hunt. I mean, they got quite a bit of talent over there. They just really don't live up to expectations, it seems like. But got Baker Mayfield after him, and we're going to see if we can go get another win. We had the Baltimore Ravens, AFC North, Indianapolis Colts, AFC South, Cleveland Browns, AFC North, and then the Jacksonville Jaguars are next week. But we're back in contract and negotiations, and we're getting Corey Davis locked up for the next three years. And it's honestly just a way for us to kind of monitor more his situation, see if he continues to grow. And if he does, we'll get him another extension going into his 30s. We're now scouting the outside linebackers. We're finally looking at defensive players. And we're looking for speed rushes and pass rushes. We're not really too worried about the run stoppers. Because if anything, they would more like a kick to inside linebacker. And we don't need inside linebackers. I stopped right there at the, the number two ranked guy. And uh, that is a guy out of Tennessee State University. Glad to see that, you know, he has potential. Maybe Demetrius Rice is projected as a first rounder. And the talent-wise is going to say late fourth. But not too bad. I mean, you're coming out of TSU, man. Hey, that's, that's shout-outs to you for that. But hopefully, you know, maybe you do turn out being a good player here in this draft. I don't know if you'll be there when we pick, but we'll see. We're going to go ahead and start scouting, actually, the strong safeties as well. Because, honestly, Kenny Vaccaro, his slowness really affects what we can do in the secondary. But we're going to go ahead and get into the game. You see the AFC playoff picture. 9-2 Ravens, 9-2 Titans. We're at the 2 seed. This is a big game. We're showing this kickoff right now because if you look at the bottom, the Dallas Cowboys have beaten the Baltimore Ravens, and that moves the Ravens now down to the two seed and us at the one seed. If we win this game, we will be number one. And now there's only one bye week. So we do not want to be playing on wild card weekend when we can potentially get that first round bye and home field advantage with only one team getting a bye. But here comes Baker Mayfield leading the squad out. He had a 3-1 to one touchdown interception ratio. He's firing on the first play of the game. Jeffrey Simmons put the pressure on. He tried to hit Odell Beckham. And that's going to be an incomplete pass to start off the game for Baker Mayfield. Shotgun formation on 36. Looking downfield. He's going to dump it down to his man in the flat. Nowhere to go. Good coverage on the play. And that's going to set up a 3 and out. And we will take the ball right back. As Ryan Tannehill stats. You can just kind of put a black bar over all that. I mean, it's been a struggle for him this year. And we don't know what we're really going to do. Second and eight here. Back to pass. Going to find his man. is A.J. Brown. Brown looking for a pickup from Davis. He gets the block, and he gets a solid catch and run on that quick slant. They sent an all-out blitz, and A.J. Brown able to take advantage, getting us with a good gain on that one, a first down and a lot more. As we're back to pass here, Tannehill's finding his man. It's going to be another first down grab as A.J. Brown once again picking up the first down. We're on the move, closing in on the red zone. Second and 10 here, handoff. Derrick Henry has it. He's going to pick up a good gain of about eight, maybe nine, depending on where they marked it. It is going to be bring up a third and two, though. Handoff Henry to the outside. Henry got good blocking to the five. Extended for the goal line. He's not going to get it, but it is going to bring up a first down and goal from the one. Our formation, handoff Derrick Henry. Touchdown, Titans! And Derrick Henry will walk into the end zone basically untouched. He's dancing, and the crowd is hype in the back. See, so end up getting our first score of the game. He does go in untouched. But uh, <laughs> he got, um, that's our first lead we've had in a game. In a, actually, now we had a lead early on. In that Ravens game, we were able to take a uh, Corey Davis was able to take one to the house. And speaking of taking one to the house, Odell Beckham absolutely blasts by Malcolm Butler, and it is a no contest foot race. 
to that end zone. Odell does this so many times. And our defense gives up a slant route for six, probably more than any other team in the league. Play action pass back to throw. Hit as he throw from Miles Garrett. Corey Davis went up high but could not come down with the catch. And it'll bring up second down, but we're going to skip to third down and 10 right here. Back to throw. Looking downfield under pressure once his man and Corey Davis just saves an interception. And we have to send out Brett Kern as we go on a three and out. First and 10 for Baker Mayfield. Lining up in our formation. Under pressure. Pass. And he is going down in Jadavion Clowney. It's all over Baker Mayfield on that one. Wanted to take a shot downfield and couldn't get it off. Second and 18, back to throw. Looking, has a man and a great throw from Baker. Picks up the first down, and the Browns are now on the move inside our territory. Hand off Kareem Hunt. Hunt with a great spin move. It's going to be wrestled down, but not before he gets the first down. Adore Jackson on the play. And now Jeffrey Simmons is hurt once again. You got to be kidding me. That's the second time he's going to be out. Back to throw. Has his man there. Kevin Byer was going for an interception. But Njoku fights his way all the way down to the one-yard line. And that is going to set up a first and goal. The Browns are looking to take the lead. And Jeffrey Simmons is going to be out with a torn labrum. Who knows how long he'll be out. First and goal handoff to Nick Chubb. And Nick Chubb makes a man miss. He was dead to rice by Mario Edwards Jr. And what in the world? I guess that's the treadmill celebration. No clue what, uh, not Kareem Hunt, but Nick Chubb is doing on that one. But that is a touchdown that will give the Browns the lead. Still don't know what the celebration was about. Hand off Derrick Henry here. Derrick Henry fighting his way, weaving in and out. Bouncing off defenders and is going to pick up a gain of nine to set up a second down and short. We need Tannehill to get something going here. Play action pass. Looking downfield. He's going to take a shot. Has his man, Janu Smith, and he had a step on the defender. Janu Smith is overthrown by Tannehill, and we had it. We had it. Third and one back to pass. Looking downfield. Going to hit his man. Is A.J. Brown picking up another first down. I believe that's his third first down grab on the day, and he's having a good one so far. Third and three here, Tannehill. He's going to hand it off Derrick Henry. Derrick Henry is going to be stuffed. The Browns were all over it, and it's going to bring up a punt from midfield to end the first quarter. First and ten. It's going to be a handoff to Nick Chubb. Chubb has a first down and a lot more, and that is a gain of 17 on the play. Defense is nowhere near in that middle of the field. Second and ten. Under pressure. Sack! And down goes Baker Mayfield. The ball is out. Ma Baker will pick it back up. Harold Landry makes sure he does not go anywhere else. And it is another sack for Jadavion Clowney, his second of the day. Second and 27. Back to pass. Baker looking at field. Has a man, and it's going to be Jarvis Landry. They caught us while we were trying to change defenses. And Christian Fulton is not able to get there in time. Third down and five. Baker Mayfield in the shotgun. Under pressure. Sack! And down he goes again. It's Daquan Jones, and he's making it really, really hard not to give him that contract extension. We're probably going to have to go ahead and pull that plug. Back to pass play action. Looking downfield, and down goes Ryan Tannehill. Get him in there on the sack is Michael Kendricks. That's a one we could not afford. Third down and 17. Back to pass. Looking downfield. Pressure coming from Miles Garrett. He's going to find his man, and he can't hang on. One of A.J. Brown again, who's had a fantastic day today so far, but he could not make the grab. Back to pass, Baker. Play action. Looking downfield. Has a man whoop, thrown right over his head. I don't know if that's on Baker or that's on the tight end, Austin Hooper. But it's going to bring up a third down to seven, and we're not complaining. Back to throw. Baker looking. Taking a shot downfield. Testing Fulton. He wanted Landry, and it is going to be a dropped interception for Fulton. And Fulton, man, he's just really not a playmaker. He's not really a big playmaker. As a second and four pass on the outside to Adam Humphreys. Picks up a first down for us. Looking to see if we can tie this game up. First and ten, back to throw. Looking downfield. Going to take his man. It's A.J. Brown once again. And all A.J. Brown today is doing is picking up first downs when he gets his hands on the ball. First and ten, back to throw. Looking downfield, still looking, has his man as Darrington Evans. Evans is going to be just shy of the first down, but he is inside Cleveland territory, and we will easily pick up the first down with Derrick Henry. Man in motion, that's John U. Smith. Play action pass, looking downfield. Tannehill still looking, taking a deep shot for A.J. Brown, and it is a bad decision. Gave it a 50-50 ball, and it is picked off by 
the Cleveland Browns on that one. And that is going to give the Browns the ball right back before the two-minute warning. Second in, I mean, first in 10, back to pass, has Hooper. First down grab, past the 30-yard line. And that's going to take us to the two-minute warning. Baker once again in shotgun, looking downfield. He's going to dump it off to his man. It's Kareem Hunt. Kareem Hunt extends for that first down line, and it's going to have it. And the Browns have an opportunity here to get points here before half. Back to throw. Mayfield has his man on the Texas Raiders. Kareem Hunt once again. Kevin Byer with the stop on the play. And the Browns are moving this ball with no issues. Five wide set. First and ten. Just over a minute to play. Looking downfield. Takes his shot. Has his man in the slot. Once again, Rashard Higgins is going to pick up a first down on us. And he has came up big on these, on these streak plays down the middle of the field. Second and three. Kareem Hunt in the backfield. Baker to throw. Pressure coming. Players are falling around his feet. Rolls out. Fires to the end zone. Odell Beckham back in the end zone. Touchdown on the play. And the Browns will go up 14. 41 seconds left. We're going to see if we can try and find and get something. Third down and 10. Flag on the play. Court Davis made the throw, but we'll see what the flag is. It's going to be pass interference on Denzel Ward. And that'll be an automatic first down. Actually, Corey Davis did not get his feet in bounds on that one. So that was huge. Second and 10 back to throw Tannehill. Looking downfield, has his man. It's Corey Davis. Corey Davis is going to be just shy of the first down. And we're going to have to call a timeout here as we're trying to see if we can get something. First and 10 back to throw. Rolling to his right. Throwing downfield. Has his man. It's John New Smith. Did he get out of bounds? And they will say yes. 16 seconds on the clock. And they have a safety coming down. Looking like he's going to blitz. We're going to motion out Jonu Smith and just send him deep. There is nobody covering Jonu Smith on this play. Shotgun formation. Back to throw. Looking for his man. Has Jonu Smith. And Jonu Smith does not stay in bounds. I don't even know why he's celebrating the first down, dude. You have to take that to the end zone. You just literally went out of bounds. Seven seconds left from the four-yard line. Goes into the end zone. Touchdown! Tight! Jonu Smith! Dancing all alone, reels it in. And that is going to be a touchdown grab. Jonu Smith makes up for it by not going straight to the end zone. Instead, he went out of bounds on the play. Tannehill finds him, and we are within one score as that's what we needed. We wanted a two for one, and we were able to get it. Let's see if now we can get the, uh, the other side of that, too. First and 10 here. Play action pass. Tannehill looking downfield. Survey in the field, finding his man, and it is a dangerous throw, but it will be caught. It's A.J. Brown on the play, and why not? A.J. Brown is having a fantastic day today, and let's keep going to him. Second and 12 here, back to pass. The ball is going to be ripped out of there. There's Miles Garrett stripping it out of there, recovered by the defensive lineman. Taylor Lewan will not have the speed to catch him. Not Just way too far of a distance, and it is a scoop. And score on the play. Tannehill's second turnover of the day. And Mike Vrabel is heated. He's yelling at the offensive coordinator. He doesn't understand why he's not giving Derrick Henry the ball more. As Ryan Tannehill's second turnover costs us more points. First and 10 here. Back to pass. Dumping it down. He's got his man. It's John New Smith on the screen play. And that's going to bring up a first down and a lot more. It's a 15-yard game. And John New Smith's fine day continues, even though that one little mistake he did have. Hand out Darius and Evans. Evans has the first down run and a little bit more. He's going to put us in Cleveland territory inside the 45-yard line. Let's see if we can cut this lead in half. First and 10, back to throw. Corey Davis was in motion, finding Davis on the play, and he'll have a first down grab. We're on the move here. Tannehill, we just don't need you to mess it up. And we know you kind of do that quite a bit. Our formation here, play action pass, looking downfield. Back to throw, still looking, under pressure, finding his man. He has it. It's A.J. Brown once again, and all A.J. Brown is doing is getting first down grabs. The man is playing his butt off today, over 100 yards. First and 10, pistol formation, handoff, Derrick Henry. Derrick Henry. And so, touchdown, Titans. Will hit the end zone to cut the lead in half. Derrick Henry touchdown. Don't know what happened at the end of that run. We tried running over somebody, but there was nobody there. And he just ended up collapsing in the end zone. Honestly, if you see that and realize you would hate, you would fear the worst. You would think, oh, man, maybe there's a torn ACL there. As Baker Mayfield takes a shot here on second and seven. Great play by Kevin Byard as they tried getting a big play. Baker threw it late, though. He had his man. Would have been a first down if he would have threw it on time. Third and seven here. Back to throw. Defense looking to make a stand. Great 
Great coverage down on the field, and making the stop is a Dory Jackson, and coming up to help out is Kenny Vaccaro. That'll be a three and out, and we're going to get this ball back. Fourth and two, they're going to go ahead and send it away. Cameron Batson deep to return. Going to get this inside his own 25. Cameron Batson to the outside looking for some blocks. Has some blocks, and he's going to get a great return here before he is squeezed to that sideline. It's going to be up and bring up a first and 10 just right outside midfield. Let's see if we can go ahead and tie this game up as we see A.J. Brown having a fantastic day today. Six receptions, over 100 yards on the day. He's been a beast. Play action pass here. Looking down fit, and once again, Tannehill fumbles the football. Isaiah Simmons will get the recovery, but my goodness, Tannehill, dude, your ball security day has been awful. Third down and 21, shotgun, looking downfield. Pressure coming from Miles Garrett. He's going to throw it up there and giving Jonu Smith a chance to make a play. Tannehill throws it down there, and Jonu does the rest. 27-yard game. What a play from Jonu Smith. Let, allow your playmakers to just make the plays. Third down and eight, going to toss it out there to the flat. Derrick Henry's going to pick up a first down. It's going to set up a first and goal as we're closing in here on the fourth quarter. Let's see if we can get in here and get in this end zone for the tie. First and goal, back to throw Tannehill, looking downfield. Pressure starting to come. into the end zone. Touchdown! Tight! And it's Anthony Ferkser getting in there for the touchdown. And if I'm not mistaken, that's his first touchdown of the season. Great job by Tannehill staying calm, cool, under pressure. Being able to make that play, but let's not forget the third down grab that John New Smith made. And actually, let's give a lot of credit to Isaiah Wilson for recovering that fumble. And you guys can see right here, setting up that next drive, EA kicked us out of here. EA just being EA, as I guess that's all you can say. But yeah, Isaiah Wilson give him a lot of credit for recovering that fumble. If we don't get it, we're not getting a touchdown on that play as Austin Hooper picks up a third down and seven to start this fourth quarter off. First and ten, or excuse me, second down and four here. Baker Mayfield under center looking downfield. Going to drop it down underneath. Is Austin Hooper breaking through a tackle. Austin Hooper has the first down, and they are inside Titan territory. They're looking to go ahead and take this lead. Back to pass. Baker finding his man is Odell Beckham Jr. He's been a problem today with already two touchdowns in this one. First and ten, our formation. Odell to his left. They're going to hand it off. Nick Chubb to the outside. He's able to get that edge, and Chubb has a first down. Broke out of a tackle from Vaccaro. Odori Jackson saves it from getting any bigger than what it was. Third and four here. Back to pass. Looking downfield. Looking. Has his man, and he's going to be denied of the end zone. A big hit from Odori Jackson and Kenny Vaccaro as they prevent the touchdown. Second and goal. Can the defense make a stand here? Hand off and getting belted on the play by a stiff arm from Nick Chubb. Kevin Byard. Oh my goodness, it's going to be one of the worst stiff arms you are going to receive. Ryan Tannehill is upset. And my goodness, what a stiff arm. My gosh. Kevin Byard just absolutely destroyed on that one. Put him on his back. And wow. Ryan Tannehill, you can see he was upset because he knows he's got to go out here and try and make a play. As we hit A.J. Brown, who's been making plays all day, grabbing another first down. First and 10, back to throw, Tannehill once again. Looking downfield, and he fumbles it again. And this time it's going to be scooped up once again by the Browns. The second fumble recovered for the Browns. The third fumble for Tannehill, and Tannehill is literally losing his mind with his ball security. My goodness, as Kareem Hunt fights his way, picking up a first down and goal. Three minutes left. I mean, we literally need a turnover here. Back to pass. Baker looking. Baker firing, and he has his man. It's Higgins. Higgins has been a problem for us today. And honestly, everything for their team has been a problem for us in this one. First and 10, play action pass. Tannehill looking downfield. Finding his man. He has it. It's Jonu Smith. Jonu Smith stays in bounds to get a few extra yards. It may have been a mistake, but we'll see. No huddle going for Tannehill. Shotgun formation still. Back to pass. Looking downfield. He's going to have his man. It's Adam Humphreys on the play. Humphreys picks up some first down. And we are on the move here inside Cleveland territory. Another first down. Tannehill still keeping the play drive alive. Going to find his man. And oh my goodness, it was almost another turnover for Tannehill. Bad throw. And he almost threw it into a pick. Back to throw. Looking for Derrick Henry on the play. And it is intercepted. By the Browns, once again, another turnover for Tannehill. His fourth of the day. 
Jackson. That one just may do it here in this one. I'm going to run out of time. Under two minutes. Third down and four. If we don't get a stop and they don't and they don't miss the field goal, it's pretty much over. We haven't used any timeouts yet. Handoff. Kareem Hunt. It's going to be just shy of the first down. But they do make the field goal, and that might just do it here in this one. Finding our man, and look who it is. A.J. Brown has been fantastic today. No huddle once again. 40 seconds left. I mean, this game is all but over. Back to throw. Looking downfield. Pressure from Garrett. And once again, Tannehill misfires. This time it is intercepted once again by Carl Joseph. His second of the day. And that's going to be a loss for us in this one. We split the the AFC North rivalry. Uh, I guess you, well, you pretty much call that a rivalry. I mean, that's an old school rivalry for, for the Titans. But we end up splitting that one. We were able to beat the Steelers and the Bengals. But fall to the Ravens. And the Browns, man, like that's that's tough. That is tough. Tannehill, honestly, that pass rating should be a lot lower if they counted fumbles for that. But to me, this may have been Tannehill's worst played game of the season. And we still have question marks about what we're going to do. I mean, the turnovers alone are what killing us. What a fantastic day for A.J. Brown. You hate that kind of effort got wasted. A.J. Brown and uh, John Luke Smith both played their butts off. Adore Jackson led us. In, well, tired for the lead in tackles with um, Christian Fulton. Tackle for a loss was by J.R. Brown in this one. We were able to get a few sacks in this one. Jadavion Clowney got two. Daquan Jones another. But our biggest issue, we uh, for defensively we gave up a lot of big yards. I mean, we were giving up chunks. But we also did forced no turnovers in this one. And that, that may have had to do with I mean, that could have possibly cost us, but, I mean, if you ask me, this blame definitely goes on. Ryan Tannehill, I mean, the defense, yes, they didn't do their job as much, but Tannehill's five turnovers down. The fifth one, the game was already over. But that last one he had before, well, but turnover number four and turnover number three were definitely the biggest factors in this one. See, we got a couple upgrades. Johnny Smith and Isaiah Wilson will both get nice upgrades which are both very needed. Isaiah Wilson, once again, he had the, the fumble recovery that helped us keep that one drive alive. And it did help because we were able to get in the end zone, but it wasn't enough. That's Jeffrey Simmons is going to be out five weeks with a torn labrum, so he'll be out a month. I don't know what kind of torn labrum heals within a month, but from whatever I've heard, they don't heal that fast. So Jeffrey Simmons' injury clearly wasn't that, that bad. But to be honest, let's, let's be honest, EA did not make a torn labrum. Just, I mean, they, they made that torn label pretty much up. I mean, really? You're going to be out for four weeks, really? But whatever. Uh, we got the Jacksonville Jaguars next. We got to bounce back. This is the final stretch of the season. We got four games left. Very, very winnable games. On At minimum, we should win three. We got the Packers, who will be a tough one on Sunday night. But we should be able to go out there and still be able to put up a fight with the Aaron Rodgers and Devontae Adams and all the... <laughs> all the playmakers he's able to make. But we're going to see if we can find a way to get a win against the Jaguars. We would love to get that sweep. We've already swept the Colts. But Jacksonville is next. You guys, I do want to say thank you all very much for watching the video. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you guys hit the like button, leave a comment, hit that subscribe button to stay up to date with the videos I'll be posting of this Tennessee Titans series and more. I mentioned last time, you know, I'm doing a live stream with the New York Giants, doing a rebuild with that, doing that with one of my boys. It's an online franchise. Ironically enough, he actually is the Jacksonville Jaguars with his. You can find him at on what to land Twitch to uh, check out his videos. So we don't really have a time, like I said last time. So we're just kind of doing it when we can, when we're online at the same time. But that is going to do it for me, you guys, in this one. Thank you all very much for watching. I'm out to next time, everybody. Y'all stay safe out there and peace. And it's the love from my fans got me still here.